good morning guys welcome to today's video today this video is sponsored no just joking this video is not sponsored by where is it where's the logo by a cowgirl up with green but i wish it was they need to sponsor us why why you ask because we love their products I swear every single show that we went to this summer, which is only two, where where the cowgirl up with green booth was, ugh, we just bought so much stuff. I got this Navajo hoodie, I think it's called. It's really weird, like it's how it's set up. It has two hoods. You guys saw Julia and Gabby, no, Julia and Sophie wearing it the other day in our vlog, but it has two hoods. It has this little side panel, has the cowgirl up with green logo, and then it has these sleeves, and then it has like the thumb holes. It's just so roomy and feels so good, and it's so cute, like it looks good. I love the black one, they didn't have it. Um, they didn't have it available in my size, so I ended up getting this gray one. I love it, like absolutely love it. And then, Sophie got these joggers. I don't think you guys can really see. It has the logo here and they have a pocket. It's like the, they're called the joggers. And Sophie got them and she did not like them. So I took them. And uh, oh man, oh man, they're so comfortable. I don't think it's that she didn't like them. It's just that she liked the other pants that she got so much more. So she loved those and she didn't really like these as much. I put these on, oh, they are so comfortable. They have a drawstring, they have pockets, but they're not like your typical joggers that are so loose and baggy. They're like kind of a fitted jogger. They're, all of their products I find are like casual clothes but kind of made so that they can be fancy and not fancy fancy but you can kind of dress them up it's like they're they feel like comfortable clothes but they're kind of like you can dress them up and look good but anyways i love them i love cowgirl with green they have such good products another thing that we got where did it go another thing that we got i think i took it upstairs though we got a soap oh the soap is so nice too i think i might have showed you guys already anyway the girls are just finishing up wist's homeschool I want to tell you guys about our homeschool stuff journey too. I'm just making breakfast because we're getting ready to head out. And I don't usually eat breakfast early in the morning. I usually eat like, I usually don't eat breakfast. You guys, look at this. My egg turned into the shape of a heart and I did not plan that. I did not do that at all. It just turned into the shape of a heart. So this is my breakfast. I have two pieces of toast, a half of a heart on each piece of toast and then I have some grapes. Sophie is getting ready to go. It is her riding lesson day, so we're headed to the barn. Um, she's doing that. Gabby is finishing up her morning school. It's like one o'clock and we're just finishing now. We just had such a busy morning. Like Being away at the horse show the whole entire weekend has made us like a bit behind. We had a lot of catching up to do, like organizing and animals and just like a bunch of stuff. Um, but before we get going on this video and we leave, I wanted to tell you about the curriculum. Uh, you guys know that I ordered it and they're behind and now I called last Monday and said like, Hey, if you guys are behind on organizing, like sending out, shipping out curriculum, we can come and pick it up. And they said, no, we're doing great. Ruby, go away. <laughs> they said, no, no, we're doing great. It should be shipped out soon. And then it only takes a couple of days for them to ship it out. And then it still hasn't been shipped out and it is like a whole week later. So I phoned them again today and they said, oh yeah, we got, we suddenly got this influx of like, of orders and we're behind now. And I said, okay, we're going to come and pick it up. So we're picking it up on Wednesday. Our curriculum will be here on Wednesday. Um, I told you guys that I was able to print out the first chapter of all of their subjects and that's keeping us busy. I just wanted to tell you guys that I have been loving it. We've done a lot of curriculum throughout the years that we've been homeschooling and I haven't really ever loved any of it. Like it's never really been a, such a good fit. Like you know when you go to school and you're learning certain subjects and you're like, oh man, I hate this and I hate that. Well, everything has been like curriculum to get through, to get through, but this has really been eye-opening, life-changing. We are using the Life Pack, the Alpha and Omega curriculum. I've always wanted to try it, but there were a few things that were stopping me from ordering it. But this summer, I really like delved in and researched it. And the reason I really wanted to try it was because of two things, of the way it's set up. And I'll explain that to you guys. I'm gonna make a video on it. I'm really interested in the fact um, of how it's designed for the kids to be able to do it themselves. 
so I teach my kids it like we do the readings together and we go over like the questions so they kind of have an idea of what they need to do and but as time goes on and they get used to the way it's set up they should be able to pick up their books each day go off do the reading and do the questions themselves like it's set up to do that and most of the other curriculum that we've done has not been set up for them to be able to do it themselves they always need like a lot of me helping them and so this is turning out to be and I love the way the curriculum is written I love the way like Sophie's especially is written so well and so like I just love it I love the curriculum I'm gonna make a video on it in case anybody wants to know how it's been working for us a little bit later after we get the curriculum but anyway that is it that's all I wanted to tell you about the curriculum and let's get going with our horses and our lives and our day but before I do that I wanted to tell you one other thing um I wanted to like reiterate about the horse show yesterday on the weekend um how proud I was of Gabby of so many things she rode beautifully she laid down some of the best trips of her entire life like and I'm not joking I watched her ride through the camera as I was videoing and I was like wow and my friend was telling me like she looked so fluid over the jumps and she looked so balanced and united with Lily and that's what I was seeing those are the words that I needed to describe what I was seeing she Lily and her jumped so fluid and so beautifully and this is a horse that she's only been riding for a couple of weeks and she had like a really scary fall on and she like did such good rides such good rides and such competitive divisions she rode in and she placed three times and I was more proud of her rides this weekend than I was of her any of her rides winning champion like that's how impressed I was with her rides but anyway on to the rest of the video there's this new store we t I took you guys here a long time ago when it first opened it's like an equestrian store and it's getting huge like everybody goes there now and everybody knows about it and there are people staring at me because I'm talking into my camera <laughs> that's never never unawkward oh wow, it's way more way more packed now a lot more stuff oh I want new stirrups I wonder what those are like oh those are English oh these are cute look at these and they have like the leg grips. I've never seen breeches with leg grips like that before. They're nice. Gabby, do you like them? And they have like a blush color and purple color. T600. They're kind of like struck. I'll leave it to Sophie to find the treats. They're really cute. Main Delights. We know that company. I want those. Okay. All right. They have the uh, bug spray that we bought. And then they have this stuff. It's clear but it's ointment, fly ointment. But look at Gabby, I could see you wearing this shirt. This is really cute. They have nice stuff here, you guys. This is a good Christmas shopping store. I love that. And I love this navy one. Look at how nice that is. Do you like that? This is all your style. Do you like it? You do, I know you do. There's a dollar, there's uh, a bill. Sophie's still with the treats. <laughs> Yeah, they're really cute. Yeah. Shirt. yeah. And then they have this kind too. But I don't like it. You don't like it? Do you like this one? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. I love all their clothes. They all look like Gabby to me. And then they have this brand, which is Volare Equestrian. They're cute. They're a weird like a like a slinky material. Is there anything you like in here? Look at this, this stuff here. That's cute. That's a cute purse. Ear bonnet. We have, I like our ear bonnets. I love personalized ear bonnets. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, this is a nice grooming bag. It's leather. Oh, that's adorable. Do you like that? This is not leather. This part is. Yeah, and then it's like, but it's nice. The grain that we feed to Chino was on sale. So we came and we bought all the stuff that they had. And we're getting him ready to go back to the barn so Gabby can get him back into like working shape and jumping shape and show shape. And maybe show him at the last show. Alright, so we are at the barn. We're supposed to uh, have lessons. But Brandon got called into work. So sometimes that happens and we have to reschedule or cancel. 
but we still came because we have some stuff to do. We're going to take all the water that we have left over for the show. Can I actually have one though? Yeah, sure. I want to drink one on the way home because they are cold as heck. So we're going to leave them at the barn. We drink a lot of water at the barn. Uh, there is the... Hi. Hi. There is the grain that we bought from Chino. So they only had three bags left. So we bought all three bags. And Gabby's going to unload all of her stuff here too. So we were on our way here when we heard that our lessons canceled. Like that just happens sometimes. It is the nature of the beast sometimes. Lessons get canceled. Especially at like certain times of the year when it gets super busy. So... Gabby, I want to try on your helmet. My helmet? Sophie. <laughs> Sophie, we're going to try it on. So... My uh, helmet's in the car and I want to fit you. Wow, are you going to leave the whole cooler here? What? Oh. That's crazy. And you won't believe who's at the barn with us. We're here all alone. Except Elizabeth's here. <laughs> Hi, Elizabeth. I didn't show her helmet. Yeah. So, this is Sylvie's helmet. It looks a lot better. The other day she tried it on and when she tried it on I was like filming and I was like it doesn't look like it. It looked like it when she put it on it was just sitting on the top of her head. It's the same helmet that she had before though. There we go. Nice. But now <laughs> I swear sometimes big sisters <laughs> Okay. So <laughs> I think it fits okay. It definitely fits better than it looked like it fit the other day. It's the same helmet that she had before, the same size, same everything. So definitely <laughs> look like it fits. Okay, talk to Elizabeth. So <laughs> So <laughs> I knew there that was suspicious. No, you said put this in your locker. Put the water in your locker. I so said, not the cooler. So I just asked Gabby, like you're putting the whole cooler in your locker? And Gabby said, Yeah, Dad said too. Okay. And it sounded suspicious. Okay. But she actually okay. Sam actually meant like take all of it out and put it in your locker. Let's see. Huh. This looks like it's too big. No. Okay, wait, stand still. It's, it's a different time. style for sure. Hers Mine's a wide brim. So yeah. It may look yeah. bigger, but my helmet's actually. Do you have an old one here? My old one? Yeah. No. Oh, that won't fit. That doesn't fit. Oh, it works that so definitely... well on my head. Yeah. Oh, that looks. Look at my hands on the sides. Yeah, that doesn't fit. Oh, but do you see the difference in this? I think it's the style that makes it look like that because. You can literally fit my hands. Inside the helmet. I'm touching the top of the helmet. Yeah, I don't know. I'll get our coach to look at it before she rides in it. She does have another one, not the one that she fell on, but she has her last helmet still fits her. Yeah, yeah I couldn't find one. that, so I grabbed yours. Oh, but oh, well, you better grab it and bring it back home. It's in, it's the, in the car. Okay. So. And see if it fits. Yeah, it's just a different style, I think. <laughs> Unless it's supposed to sit like just above your eyebrows. It's supposed to fit like two or three fingers from you your wear, eyebrow. Oh, okay. Tilted back. A yeah, bit. So I eyebrow like two fingers. She wears yeah. it tilted back a bit, so it's not like sitting properly on her. Yeah. All and right. It's still tilted back. Actually. All right. I can't even ride today. I know you can't ride today. I've been waiting all week. Yeah. So another. He said you can come tomorrow, but we'll probably just wait until your next lesson. Can we come tomorrow? We'll see. I really want to ride. We will see. All right. All right, we're done here. Are we done here? It is so dark outside. Oh my goodness. How did that happen? <laughs> All right. Leave. I do that and it doesn't do anything. Leave that thing alone. Okay. So show them what we got. What did we get, Sophie Doodle? Don't don't call me that. Sorry, I forgot. You're too old for that now. Don't be banging into the family. <laughs> bang into it. It's there for me to bang into. We got a letter today from a beautiful girl Is that a one -kick? named Maddie. Named Maddie and she says that we are an awesome YouTuber and she loves Sophie's new horse Chance. He reminds me of Storm. Ha! Huh, I said that too. Sophie and Chance make a great team. I ride a horse named Spot and we do walk trot lessons. I also vault on a horse named Milo, vaulting is like gymnastics, but on a horse. That is so super cool. 
I think a fun video to make would be putting cameras around the barn when people aren't there. And we are going to do that. We have a lot of people asking us to do that. I hope you enjoy the photos and a painting of Finn. So Maddie, wow, look at, and she really does vaulting. Look at that. You look great, Maddie, and I love the color of Milo. I like this one more. I like this, he, this one oops, more. He is a cutie. Look at you. That horse looks like a fjord. Definitely our favorite. <laughs> Adorable. She also sent us a beautiful painting of Finn, and we love it. And Sophie will be able to keep it. I literally guessed when we got the package. I guess this is a painting. Yeah, she did. And she's gonna hang it in her room and always have a memory of Finn, right? No, I'm hanging it down here. You're hanging it down here so yeah, you can see I it all no the time. Spot on my walls. Oh, so we're gonna hang it down here. Yes. All right, or maybe you could put it by your computer. Yeah. Yeah, and then you can see it always. Yeah, we love it. Thank you so much, Maddie, for your pictures and your beautiful reminder picture of Finn for Sophie. Favorite. This is why. <laughs> Look at him. He just lays in her arms. Don't you dare poop on me. <laughs> And he just poops while he lays in her arms. <laughs> just joking. No, he didn't. He didn't poop. But look at how cute chickens are. They could be like pets, but we love him. And I was looking at him from the bottom. And he's just like laying there all calm and loosey goosey. <laughs> Sleeping. He's my favorite. Like, not my favorite, but I love him. He's he a rooster. Orange eyes. I love roosters, and I don't know why. He's talking to you guys. Hey, hi. Don't you know that you're beautiful?